Well, if you were violently attacked, could you defend yourself, learn key moves like the palm heel strike, elbow jab at a free self-defense class at the Center for Medical Weight Loss? And here to tell us more are Michelle Straka and Gabrielle Rothenthal. Welcome, ladies. Thank you. Thank you so Thank much you. for being here with us today. Okay, so when we think self-defense, you know, we, we think of maybe somebody possibly attacking us. You think you have to be strong and you have to know all these moves, but that's really not the case. Not at all. Right, not at all. Not. Um, anybody, uh, my specialty is women's self-defense, and anybody that 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 can just walk, even in a wheelchair. Mm -hmm. Well, we're going to show you. Michelle is a second-degree black belt, but I'm not, mm -hmm. and I do. I am physically fit, and I do exercise on a regular basis. But we are going to show you how easy it is for anybody to defend themselves. So somebody at a beginner's level can definitely... Well, that's me. That's you right there. <laughs> yeah, okay. She's had about five minutes of practice before, before we started today. Oh, okay, today, great. So, so we'll really so, get to know yes. what a beginner beginner's right. looks like here. Okay, now you were, you were talking about the palm heel strike, the elbow jab. What are those? Okay, the palm heel... Well, Michelle will fill you in. Actually, She's the what, pro. <laughs> what, what I want to demonstrate today is, is any part of your body can be a weapon. Uh -huh. Any part, you can use your head, your elbow, your palm. The palm can be used to go up into the nose. The elbow, you can hit to the jaw. I'll show you with yeah. the... Um, and I see, yeah. I see you have yes. a cell phone here in your hand. You actually said that my pen I actually can help pen. too. Yes. So things that we kind of carry in our purse can yeah. help us as well. Right, and things that I didn't even realize, like if you take the phone, and just by walking with your phone to your car like this every day, you, you're you're setting yourself up to be victimized. You're distracted. Right? You're, you're distracted. Not, yeah. You're not paying attention by holding a key a certain way, putting your phone away. Don't text. Don't walk. It's like don't text. Don't drive. Right. <laughs> don't walk through a parking lot and text and be on the Just phone. Just be aware but, of your surroundings. Yes, it's, that's right. that's like eighty percent. Okay. Prevention. Prevention. Well, let's show you what we can yeah, do. Yeah, I'm going to grab if, this if and you go ahead and, and show us. Prevention is pen? the key. Uh, in a minute. In a minute. Okay. okay. The prevention so. in the, is is the key to that. And what we are going to do is we will demonstrate an elbow strike two ways, this way and down. So, basically, if you're talking on the phone that you shouldn't be, and somebody comes up and grabs you, you can jab up to the nose, oh, counter, <clears throat> elbow, and elbow. And you just Make learned that, huh, Gabriella? You just learned that she five just minutes learned ago. This right before we got here. I okay. And then what I wanted to borrow your uh, you key is I've I've showed her for five minutes of training is if somebody if you happen to have a key a key's good an ink pen if somebody grabs you you can use it stick come down and oh my gosh you can throw them. Are you okay? <laughs> no, I'm good. All this with an ink pen. Okay, so I mean, I've also heard about you mentioned the car keys, putting the car keys kind that of in between your fingers, fingers and, and walking down. with it. Now, there's certain parts of the body that we should target. I've heard of kind of throwing your purse at the person's face. Face, the eyes are good, the nose, um, the groin for a guy, kneecaps. El you know, locking the elbow, breaking the elbow, mm -hmm. just simple things like that. Let me okay. show you. We um, have a board, okay? okay. And what I want to show you is a board is, is I, I have everybody breaking a board for an empowerment. It's, it's equivalent to breaking a rib. So if you can oh break this, you can break a rib. Okay. Nose. <laughs> Nose. Now, I, just, I just practiced this one time outside. Uh huh. So this is a palm heel okay. strike, and this is what w would happen to your nose. You could kill somebody. Oh my gosh! Wow, very impressive. I like that you so, that you're a beginner because then yeah. we know that we can all try this and we can all do this. Now, Gabrielle, really quick, we only have a few seconds left. You actually said that you thought of these self-defense classes to kind of empower women because you are a weight loss center. Yes, I lost 130 pounds. I was a size 26, and I I realized talking to a lot of people, especially a lot of women, that uh, their self-confidence is shattered. They, they're lost. They're lost in their world and. And uh, Michelle was actually one of our patients, mm -hmm. and she lost some weight for a boxing match. And um, I, I, it just, I dreamt about it one day. I woke up, I said, that's it, <laughs> That's how you empower yourself. Right. And it's amazing, it's amazing. It's, the results are amazing, well, I and mean, I feel strong. Well, you look strong, <laughs> both of you do. Thank you, ladies, yes, so much for being for here. Us. And the next free self-defense class is Friday, August 19th at 6.30 p.m. at the Center for Medical Weight Loss, located at 2209 North University Drive in Pembroke Pines. To reserve a spot, call 954-966-5700. Roxy, over to you.